Hey, earlier we showed you Virginia Beach swells, but the effects of Ernesto, they're being felt up and down the East Coast. Here's a look at Coney Island, where all the city beaches across Brooklyn and Queens, along with Jacob Reese Beach, they're going to be close to swimming today in anticipation of the uh, dangerous rip currents that we've been talking about. That according to city and national park officials. Mike, that is no joke, those rip currents, man. Yeah, and that's responsible from <laughs> Ernesto sending out all those waves with yeah. the big uh, wind activity you had. For the day today, we'll have three to maybe six foot waves in Virginia Beach. Wow. And we may get a little line here near the Outer Banks, not only later today, but tonight into tomorrow of some waves between six and nine feet. So we have high risk of rip currents all across the Virginia and North Carolina beaches. Down Virginia Beach, three to five, maybe six foot sure. waves if you're going a little bit offshore there. And four to nine foot waves down by the Outer Banks. And things will calm down a little bit Tuesday, Wednesday, but we still may have the dangerous rip currents even though the waves go down a little bit. And that's why we're seeing those red flags, some double red flags. Yes. Which closing the beaches all together down there. That's true. So things will get better in the next couple days. It'll just be a little rough today and tomorrow. Right.